over the years, you know, once you're out of the Army and you're in reality again, uh, you, you lose that sense of tribe that, you know, when you're in the military, you feel like you're in a tribe and you come back and you're around people that can't relate to the stories that you talk about. And it, it and you, you deal with when the quietness hits, you deal with, and that's, that's why it's so important to get these guys out of their houses because they're stuck in this quietness and they're thinking in their heads about all the bad things that they, they could have did, whether it was going right or going left or being there at a certain time. What makes it extremely difficult is those guys feel like they should have did something better or should have been there and they, they live with because when a brother dies, they automatically assume, they feel like he's a better man than they'll, he'll ever be. And one of the things that I tell guys all the time when they're dealing with survivor's guilt is, why even think about putting a gun in your mouth and pulling the trigger or doing anything to harm yourself? I tell these guys all the time, you know, I lost buddies too. Lost, we lost 68 in my battalion while we were over there. Cap and I's battalion, we lost 68 total. And a lot of those guys, a lot of the veterans across the country are dealing with survivor's guilt and that's why a lot of them are committing suicide. That's why we have the 22 veterans a day that, that because they're dealing, a lot of them are dealing with survivor's guilt. And I try to tell as many people that I'm with that are struggling with survivor's guilt is what's it gonna do for the, your buddies that died over there by putting a gun in your mouth and pulling the trigger? It's not doing anything for them because the reason they're still here is because of our brothers that died over there. We're here to tell their stories and live on for them, to honor them for the rest of our lives so they're not forgotten about and lost in history. That's why we have the motto, never forgotten.